so welcome back to the channel everyone you have read the title correctly your eyes aren't deceiving you i did go ahead and put braids in my hair even though i said i wouldn't but honestly i was just like really tired of having short hair and feeling uncomfortable with how i looked so yes i installed braids and i'm just showing you what i did so before I did the braids, I did pre-poo my hair and, you know, shampoo it, deep condition it, make sure that I was working or starting off with a clean slate. I'm showing you the hair that I used. So it's from a brand called Smart Braid. It's synthetic hair, not too long because I don't want it to be too heavy on my scalp and it's supposedly lightweight as well. So hopefully that will help with not creating too much tension and pulling on my follicles. I tried to avoid braiding the recipient area because we're trying to be really careful here with those transplanted hairs. I did braid some of it, as you can see there, but most of it was left out. These took me about seven hours in total, I believe, to install, even though they're not too small, but I just work really slowly, it turns out. You can see there that I left the perimeter of my head out because I'm not trying to create any tension onto my newly transplanted hairs. After I had finished installing the braids, I did dip them in hot water to make them curly. And when I go to sleep, I've started covering my head with a satin bonnet, but I'm not putting the bonnet over my edges because I don't want to cause unnecessary tension there. So yeah, these are what the braids look like after I took them out nice and curly. And this is how I plan to rock my hair for the next few weeks or so. Let me know your thoughts in the comments.